Good morning, my name is Lachey, and I'm doing a book review on The Great Gatsby. Now, The Great Gatsby was a book that we just finished reading for English class, but it to me, it was much more than just, you know, an English project. I really enjoyed the book. I really enjoyed reading the book. And, you know, it's a book that was, that took place in the 1920s, so the Roaring Twenties, and it kind of just, you know, follows life of, like, the wealthy and the elite in, in the 1920s. The main character, Nick Carraway, uh, is one of those, you know, newly rich, newly, you know, put into that wealthy society and he kind of, you know, meets new these people when he, he spectates essentially. He spectates the lives their lives and the events that go on in this in this little period. And I thought that it I thought it was a really good book. There was a lot of plot twists, especially towards the end. It's it's kind of short, to be honest with you. It's a lot shorter than I thought it would be. And Yet, you know, it was still riveting. It was still enjoyable. So it's something that you can get done pretty much in one sitting if you really wanted to. It's pretty quick. It's pretty easy. Uh, yeah, the ending The ending was spectacular. It's really, really, really good. It takes you by surprise. Nothing, you know, you never really expect it. There's, you know, plot twist upon plot twist. The character development, although, you know, it's, it's not that much. There's a lot of exposition that kind of like shows you the character developments of each each and every character basically and it's it's very it's very tastefully done i really think that you know this is one of scott fitzgerald's like best work he really you can tell he put a lot of his you know his own personal experiences because he also deals with you know infidelity with his wife and that was around the time period that he wrote the great gatsby so you can kind of see that you know there's there's his there's aspects of his own life in the great gatsby and it's really cool it's kind of it's really interesting to see you know as as the book develops Overall, I would say probably a 9 out of 10 for this book. I felt like, you know, it could have been a little bit longer, I think, in a sense. But it's it's pretty short enough to where you can, you know, you kind of get a feel for this life. But it kind of, like, leaves you wanting more, which I think is always good for books. You never want to finish a book and not really, you know, and and not feel like there was, there was more to be to be read. Overall, I think, you know, you... What's what's interesting and what's kind of good about this book is that there really isn't a good guy in a sense. There's no good guys. Each character themselves is, has has their own bad sides, has bad qualities to them. So you can kind of see it's kind of interesting to see how you know you you can't really pick sides for anybody to be honest with you because every single character is a horrible person and you just develops that you see that whether they start off as good you know they end bad or you know they've always been bad from the beginning. You you end up sympathizing to be honest with you so you sympathize with a lot of the characters and you also you know see that none of them are really good it, at heart none of them are good even the main character himself although he'll never admit that you it's, it's clear to see that you know he, he's not good because his his whole trope is not you know not judging people and yet he spends most of the book judging people things like that you know it being written from the first person perspective i think you know adds a lot of life to the book and you know makes it that much more enjoyable to read so i think you'll you'll you'll, you'll find it i think for everybody you know it's one of those books that you kind of have to read i think and it's not long enough to where you know it's a chore to read it's something that's pretty quick i think it was about yeah it's about it's a little less than 200 pages it's pretty it's pretty short it's but it's a good read i think overall and i think that anybody who reads this will enjoy it thank you very much for listening